More than a thousand fortune seekers have flocked to a village in South Africa's KwaZulu-Natal province to dig for what they believe to be diamonds after a discovery of unidentified stones in the area. The diamond rush started on Saturday after a local herder made a find in an open field. Aruna Ayanga has the story. Jubilation at the discovery of gems in the village of Kwathlati in KwaZulu-Natal province. Fortune seekers believe these gems could change their lives. I've never seen or touched a diamond in my life. It's my first time touching one here. I hope this will make a difference at home because we're really struggling. So I hope things will be better. But are they diamonds or quartz crystals? That's yet to be determined. South Africa's Mines Department is sending a team of geological and mining experts to the site to analyse the stones. And the provincial government has tried to stop the digging, saying it's illegal mining activity. Illegal or not, there's a brisk trade in these stones by those hoping to make some money. Many here struggle to earn a living. South Africa's unemployment rate is running at 32 per cent. Youth unemployment is at a record high. After pictures and videos of the gems circulated on social media, people have travelled from all over South Africa to come here. And this is what it means. This means our lives will change because no one had a proper job. I only do odd jobs. When I returned home with the stones, the family was really overjoyed. This will really help the community. We hope crime will come to an end, especially crimes against women, because the youth do all these things because of unemployment. Police are keeping a watch on events. The provincial government has asked the diggers to leave. They've also suggested that people here could be spreading coronavirus. For now, the opportunity to make money from the ground is a more pressing concern. Aruna Iyengar, BBC News. Huge crowds there in KwaZulu-Natal looking for their fortunes. That